We are going to the orchard. So in keeping with tradition we started last year, we are stopping at the You Pick Orchard on the way home from the Gluten Free Fest. My phone is, why is my phone vibrating? Oh, Pokemon. Um, <laughs> it's like, why is it vibrating? We're going to do You Pick Apples at this orchard because it's really hard to find them and Gluten Free Fest was great. Links in the description for that vlog. And now we're here at the apple orchard and we're going, wait, oh, there it is. We're going to pick some apples. We've got a nice start here. I don't like big apples. I specifically only like small apples. Wait. <sighs> I haven't really found very many yet. Wine sap? Stamen wine sap. Yeah, I like Jonathan apples because they're nice and small and sweet. Um, the wine sap's the ones with red in them? No, I think that's Pink Lady. I don't know. I don't know apples. <laughs> Look at all of these little golden delicious. They're smaller too. One? You want to pick this one? Bigger than anything. Both. There you go. Put it in the back. Okay, we finally found the jackpot. This is the very last row of apples in the orchard. But we found all the Jonathan, and there's shade. Also, a lot of apples on the ground, but I mean, take your pick. Yes. Uh, that one. This one goes. Try to get that one. Got it? There's a bunch of low ones over here. Take that one. Smaller ones too. Okay, Abigail, mm -hmm. come here. Mm -hmm. okay, so we don't climb. December, I gain weight. Oh, I know. It's and the apples and the pumpkin and. I gain weight and. Look how beautiful out. these are. Gorgeous, beautiful it's red okay, apples. Yeah, there's... Oh, that just just popped right off. That is perfect. Cool. You look confused. <laughs> <I'm> tired. <laughs> yeah, it's a little warm. It's a little, it's a little confusing because last time we were here, it was really cold outside, and today it's like 90 degrees. So my body is confused. Also, throw back to stuck in an apple tree. Not stuck this time. Just in the shade because it's nice and cool. <laughs> Isaiah just completely ate an apple except for like the tiniest little bit in the middle. It must have been a really good apple. <laughs> Abigail, how was your apple? She's still eating that. Oh, you still piece. It must be really good. Look at that. Never seen kids eat apples so well. We ended up getting another half peck in addition to our. Would we get another a peck or a half bushel? No, the one before. Okay, it was a half. Half bushel. No, quarter bushel. A peck. <laughs> a bushel and a peck. <laughs> but yeah, we ended up getting another one because we found so many good apples. Unlike three trees, we just... Yes. There were so many. Done. I'm so happy. Time to uh, eat a bunch of apples. <laughs> <laughs> and they had honey sticks. You guys, honey sticks are... One of my favorite things ever, and hardly anyone sells them, and I got honey sticks. Um, I know now this has to be a thing. We go to Gluten Free Fest, and then we'll come get apples and honey sticks after. It's very exciting. However, I know this one is green apple, but these are all three different flavors. One of them is natural cinnamon, one of them is wild orange blossom, and one of them is clover. And I don't know which one's which, because they all look the same. So it's a, it's a little surprise bag of honey. It tastes good. That's all I know. <laughs> How are yours? What flavor did you get? White. Um, green apple. Green apple. What one's yours? Is yours blue raspberry or blueberry? Well, you got green apple too, yeah. And peach. Blue raspberry. You got blue raspberry, and Isaiah got blueberry. Lots of fun flavors. There are butterflies on this tree, and they're cute. I'm trying not to get close because I don't want to scare them. But there are several different kinds, just like chilling on our tree. Um, they don't look like the kind that we had. Okay, when they're closed up from the side, these two here oh, one flew. It just looks like a leaf on the tree from the side when it's closed. Isn't that cool? 
I never knew butterflies landed on trees as much. I know, and it looks like the tree. Did you see the Hi! Hello! Happy Thursday! I just got done at the dentist. I had a very quick appointment. My dentist never takes very long. It never takes more than 20 minutes. Tops. My appointment was at 1.40. It's 1.58. <laughs> so, quick trip to the dentist. Got done with the dentist. Waiting for my phone to turn back on because our dentist is... They're kind of weird. I like them because they're gentle. I never get hurt by them and they don't take very long. However, they have a weird like phobia of cell phones. <laughs> so they don't let you have your phone turned on inside and they make you put it in like this closet. It's, it's weird. Um, but they're good at teeth cleaning. So, I mean, it works out. Um, but I just got to the dentist. It's been a very busy morning. Mom had a doctor's appointment that she couldn't go any other time. They only had an opening right in the middle of Isaiah and Abigail's swim gymnastics class. So I had the kids, well, Nancy helped me. Nancy's my sister. Um, <laughs> she's not on the vlog very much. She doesn't like really being on camera, but I do have a sister, Nancy. She's 18, almost 19. Um, she helped me. So I had the kids then, and then as I was leaving this morning, because we drove separately, mom and yeah, anyway, as I was leaving, I got a call from someone from the food pantry who was like, um, there's this whole thing with our delivery got messed up and it's supposed to come on Tuesday, but it came today instead. And I couldn't be there to help because it was the one Wednesday, one Thursday that I couldn't go. So as soon as they were done with swim and gymnastics, I took them home. I drove back out to the pantry because I'd also left my cup there yesterday and they had literally just finished doing everything they were going to do. So I felt bad just showing up then. And then I, uh, took a pallet because they had extra pallets and dad wanted a pallet so I took ho home a pallet got that out of the trunk and then I left again to go to the dentist now I'm done with the dentist and I'm getting ready to stop by Kroger because they supposedly have some Halloween candy that's 50% off I don't know why because it's a month early but they have like a special thing today it says select candy I don't know which ones exactly um, or if I'm gonna want any of them but it's today only so I'm gonna go check it out see what they have and maybe get some delicious candy because that's what you do after you go to the dentist <laughs> you buy candy all right I'll uh, let you know how the candy hunt goes <laughs> okay so it's later in the day on Thursday my chair is spinning by itself why um, anyway busy day today uh, I came home from the grocery store for the second time. I went to Kroger, got some candy, was excited, came home, started laundry, then decided I wanted to go back to Kroger and do this week's shopping because I didn't want to go tomorrow. Get to that in a second. <laughs> because I was already busy today mostly. And so I was like, well, I'm already busy today. Might as well just do Kroger today. Plus I get candy. So I went back to Kroger, got our groceries, got more candy, came home, made dinner, did Abigail's hair. So I just finished that. It is good for the evening. I just have to finish we're gonna have to do the style tomorrow. Anyway, but I did find lots of candy. Well, not lots of candy. Actually, I was disappointed they didn't have any, okay, why is my chair spinning by itself? That's weird. I was disappointed they didn't have any like Butterfingers, which are one of my favorites. They didn't have any of those included in the sale, but I did get these. So I got Snickers, I got a variety pack, and I got Skittles, and then that's more of the same thing. So, hooray for the, the candy, because I definitely need it. Um, but yeah, tomorrow is Friday. We always have, well not always, but we have rehearsal Friday evenings, so the evening is gone. And then I have to take a shower tomorrow morning. And then also, Grey's Anatomy comes back tonight, and it's a two hour series premiere, like it's two episodes. And I don't have cable, so I have to wait until tomorrow morning to watch it on Hulu. So I really would like to be able to watch that and take my shower without having to worry about timing. Yes, I plan my Kroger trip around Grey's Anatomy. It's a problem. <laughs> also, I just started watching Supergirl, the, sh the TV show. It's on Netflix. Well, s yeah, there's two seasons so far. Now, I am never into like sci-fi fantasy stuff at all. Like it took me forever to watch Star Wars. I finally watched it last year when I went to visit Aubrey, my friend Aubrey. Um, and then I really liked it, but I'm, I've never been into like sci-fi stuff because I don't like things to not be possible. Like I don't like the premise of my show to not be possible, but this show you guys is so good. It converted a non sci-fi fan. It's so good. I started watching it because Kyler Lee is on it and she played Lexi in Grey's Anatomy. So it does stem from Grey's. She, pl she played Lexi in Grey's Anatomy and now she's on this show. Um, she's 
playing a character named Alex, which is <laughs> interesting. But yeah, it's a really good show, and I finished all of season one in the last four days? Five days? Which is as fast as I was watching Grey's, so it's really good. I really like it. I recommend it, even if you don't ever like sci-fi fantasy type stuff. Try it out and see. Well, like, maybe like over 13 or 14. It's not really a kid's show. But yeah, so I've been obsessed with that. And also Jeremy Jordan is in it, who was Jack in Newsies, and that was a shocker. The first episode, and he walked in and I was like, it's Jack. <laughs> he hasn't sang yet, and I'm only just starting season two and he hasn't sang yet, so I'm crossing my fingers for a musical episode, because Grey's had a musical episode, and I would love for <laughs> a Supergirl musical episode. <laughs> Y'all get on that, producers. All right, anyway, it's time for me to go. It's late. I want to watch more Supergirl, and I need to go to bed, because I've had a very busy day tomorrow, clearly. <laughs> um, but yeah, thanks for watching the vlog. I hope you enjoyed this week's, and I will see you, um, oh, oh, I'll see you on Monday. Yeah, fun video coming Monday. Oh, super fun video coming Monday. I'm excited. See you then. Shall we begin?